You think they put me on that bus for my good behavior? That's the bus to Blackrock. Blackrock? Yeah, you know. Black Rock Federal Pen. <laughs> Where they put the worst of the bad people. People too bad for the mainland. <laughs> Hello? Is this the radio station at Perseverance Mills? Is there a doctor with you? You need to take my message. You need to deliver it for me. It's important. Ask for Atwood. Atwood. Got it. What's the message? Wintermute. Just that. Atwood will know what it means. What's in the case? I have no idea. Should I show you what happened to the last person who lied to me? She didn't look so pretty after I was done. She? Don't worry, pilot. You'll be with her soon. Why do we have to carry this sack of shit? He's heavy as hell! Shut the fuck up! Mathis says carry the asshole. We carry him. They're getting closer. You hear about what happened to Leclerc? Don't believe everything you hear, dumbass. Arrow in the chest, man! The chest! No wolves be doing that. Really? Wolves don't use bows. You figure that out all by yourself? Piss off. Something's hunting us out here, and it ain't just wolves. Mathis will figure it out. What the hell are we even doing out here? Remember the plan. First we get Daughter out. Donner! That crazy fucker! This is bullshit! Shh. He's coming back here. Order. Hey! Hey, Mathis! He's finally awake. Well, well. He lives. No thanks to you. Turns out you have a damn hard head, pilot. I told you I was stubborn. Woman. Hmm. Oh, you mean the one you asked about in the dam? Yeah. She's still there. Won't be going anywhere soon. You bastard. Relax, Mackenzie. She had nothing to do with you. How do you? Just some old lady lost in the woods. Wandered into the dam when I was there. She saw me and wouldn't stop screaming, so I shut her up. Monster. <laughs> oh, you have no idea. Why are you so worried about her? I. It doesn't matter. Could it have anything to do with this? I told you, I have no idea what that is. Well, it's okay, pilot. We'll find a way to open it very soon. And then we'll both know what's inside. Hey, uh, Mackenzie? Yeah. You look like shit. 
shit, Mathis. How long we have to carry this heavy bastard for? Shut up, man. That heavy bastard may be our ticket off this rock, so carry him. And like the man says, shut the fuck up. They found us! free. Where did he go? You'd better get him, or there'll be hell to pay. Any sign of him? No, nothing but those fucking wolves. I need a smoke. Never mind the wolves. We gotta find him fast. What the hell? Let him run. He won't get far with those wolves hunting him. Look, you dumbass. Mathis says the pilots are taken off this damn island. Don't you want to get back to the mainland? But Eller! The arrow in the chest, man! Let's go find this guy before Mathis loses his temper again. You know what he's like when he's angry. Let's go. Between Mattis and the wolves, I have a bad feeling about this place. Rusty saw blade. Might be sharp enough to cut this rope. Looks like I finally found a use for your metal case. <laughs> we have unfinished business, pilot. Stick around. There you are. Well, welcome to the shit show. Okay. So who are you? Unfortunately, I run this place. That doesn't seem to be working out too well for you. Yes, well, normally I'm on the other side of the bars. Name's Franklin. I'm warden here at Black Rock. And you are? Mackenzie. 
Franklin, what's going on here? The situation is this. You and I are locked up in here. Mathis and his gang of thugs are trying to break someone out of solitary. We're still alive, for now, so they must need us for something. The power's been out for days, and nobody is coming to help. Sounds about right. So, Mathis, you know him? Oh yeah, we go way back. He was in for murder on the mainland about ten years ago. He did seven and then got off on parole. I was warden at one of the federal pens there, and, well, let's just say Mathis isn't sending me any Christmas cards these days. Any idea what he's doing here? Unfortunately, yeah. He's here for Donner. Donner? Who's that? His son. Shit. So, some kind of twisted family reunion. Mathis is bad, but he's old school bad. Murder, larceny, the occasional heist, and grand theft auto. But Donner? He's a chip off the old block, and then some. So, not a good person. Well, he's locked up in Blackrock, isn't he? Listen, Mathis is bad, but Donner is something much worse. I've seen a lot of criminals in my years, and Donner, he's one of those guys that keeps wardens like me up at night. He's evil to the core. He's the kind of guy they make prisons like Black Rock for. There's no redemption for guys like Donner. They aren't here for rehabilitation. There's no way back to living in regular society again. They just want to destroy the world you and I live in. If Mathis is bad, Donner is biblical bad. So, Blackrock? Yeah, maximum security prison. Built a hundred years ago and updated a few times. It's basically a fortress. Out here? You notice the walls on your way in? I was, uh, no. Okay, well, they aren't that high or that impressive, really. You know why? No idea. Because whatever dumb son of a bitch tries to escape from this place has to get through about 50 clicks of brutal terrain full of dangerous wildlife before they can even think about finding a road that leads out of here. Well, but we got here. Yeah. But are you going to get out? About 20 years ago, a pair of cons escaped. They came back three days later, half dead, begging us to take them back. And that was in the middle of summer. I get the picture. So, Donner is a very bad guy. Mathis came here to spring him. Tell me again why we aren't dead yet. Well... That's a story. Power went out here a couple of weeks ago now. The backups held for a while, but eventually the cons were able to break out and overwhelm the guards. They grabbed the keys to solitary, went to get Donner, which, well, that would have been the end. But they couldn't open the gates to solitary. Something has them locked down tight, and it's driving Mathis crazy. It was bad for us. I haven't seen any of the other guards since they locked me up in here and, well, I fear the worst. And now that Mathis is here? But with the power down, what's keeping the gates locked? There are mechanical fail-safes in the system. Keep in mind, most of this jail is pretty old. But that's not the full answer to why Donner is still locked up. What do you mean? Well, best I can tell they should have been able to break him out by now. But something, or someone, has been getting in the way. You mean, there's someone else still out there? That's exactly what I mean. But who? I don't know. But sounds like Mathis is as mad as a hornet because of them, and that brings me no small pleasure. Shit! They're coming. Get back to your bunk.
So, pilot, you're back in the land of the living. For now. Yeah, but just seeing you gives me a headache. <laughs> oh, just seeing you makes me want to hit people. So, Warden, looks like we have a little problem. I still can't get into solitary. You have any idea why that might be? I told you, Mathis, the whole jail is in some kind of weird lockdown. It all happened before you got here. Donner just... Don't you ever say his name. I, I don't know anything about it. My guys say someone's been tampering with the system. They say it's gotten worse. Every time they take a step closer to breaking into solitary, something new gets in their way. Didn't you used to run this place? Yeah. So you're telling me you have no idea how it works? That's just the thing. Nothing is working the way it's supposed to right now. Bullshit. Stop wasting my time. <laughs> and stop wasting your time. You don't have much left. Unless we get that door open. Mathis, I don't know anything. Let me jog your memory. Hey! Hey, Madness! Maybe not so hard. Like, we might still need him to get him out. Mathis, uh, he doesn't look good. You're going too far. <laughs> Clean him up. Oh, shit. He looks bad. Yeah, Mathis is getting worse. This shit with Donner has him half crazy. Half crazy? Ever since the bus crash, he's been getting wild, like a caged animal. How the hell did he expect this to turn out? You remember Montreal, right? Oh, yeah. I mean, remember that place on St. Catherine's with the girl <sighs> who... Not that, you fucking moron. Remember how Mathis broke out? Oh, yeah. I wasn't there. But I heard about it. Right. You clean up the warden, and I'll tell you all about it. So there was this really tight plan. Mathis had months to set it up. Everyone had their part to play. It was like, out of a fucking movie. So we bust out, and all hell breaks loose. We get to the front gates. <laughs> it's a mess, right? Place is in chaos. And the driver who's supposed to pick us up, he's late. No shit. No shit. So the driver pulls up, like, two minutes late. Alarms going off everywhere. It's like, the prison guards are coming after us. We're gonna get grabbed at any second. We're yelling at Mathis, come on man, let's go, let's get out of here. And Mathis just stands there, looking at the fucking driver. Looking like... He wants to eat the guy. The driver's terrified. Mathis walks over to the van, slowly. We're all jumping in and yelling to get out, and we, and we can see the fucking guards coming. Like, we are done. We need to get out. Mathis, he pulls the driver out of the van, looks back at us, and with this totally wild look in his eyes, just says, go. Like totally calmly, but with this wild edge. And he just starts beating the living shit out of the driver. Wow. I knew it went bad in Montreal, but I didn't know that story. Yeah, I mean, we took off. And Mathis, it took five cops to pull him off that driver. He cared less about being caught than he did about the driver being late. Crazy fucker. Mathis is not a patient man. 
He does not like it when a plan does not come together. He does not like to be let down. And right now, his plan for getting Donner out of here is totally fucked. It's just a matter of time before he... snaps. Like he did in Montreal. He looks bad, eh? What are we going to do? If he dies, it'll be worse for us because we'll take the heat. We need to get him patched up. Well, we passed some kind of first aid building on the way in. Great. Go there and grab some supplies. No fucking we. You hear all those wolves out there? Don't be an asshole. Go do it. You do it. Why do I have to be the one who- Hey, who went back to look for Leclerc when he went missing? No way I'm going back out there. I'll do it. Did you hear something? I said I'll do it. Let me out. And I'll get the supplies. Nobody's talking to you, pilot. Just keep quiet and hope that Mathis doesn't start paying attention to you. He dies and you guys take the rap. You want that? The rap? Take the rap? Who talks like that? Listen, pilot. Why don't you shut the fuck up? What do you have to lose? I go out there, get attacked by wolves? No great loss, right? Wait a second, man. This is a bad idea. Mathis has plans for this guy. Shut up. All right. You're right. You've been out in the bush all this time. I'm sure you figured out how to deal with a few wolves by now. We let you out. You get the supplies. The warden lives and maybe. We keep Mathis distracted so he doesn't lose his shit on you next time. Understood. You let me out. I get the supplies. The warden lives. Ha! <laughs> you see? He learns fast. Time to save the day, pilot. Don't fuck it up. Get going, pilot. The warden doesn't have much time left. And in case you're thinking of running away, remember, we still have your precious case. <sighs> Brutal, deadly cold. How I've missed you. some meds for the warden. He Hello? Hello? Who the hell are you? Well, I could ask you the same question. Quit fucking around. Who are you? I'm nobody important. Just a bush pilot. My name is... Uh, you forgot your name. My name's Mackenzie. Right. Well, Mr. Mackenzie. Not Mr. Mackenzie. Just Mackenzie. Well, Mr. Bush Pilot Mackenzie. Welcome to the party. You working for those assholes in prison? Which ones? I mean, no. No, not working for them. Then what are you doing out here? Where are you calling me from? Somewhere safe. Look, Mr. Mackenzie, soon you're gonna have to figure out whose side you're on in this little stalemate we have going on. I don't know anything about a stalemate. And I'm not on anyone's side. I'm on my own side. Well, at least you're honest. That's a start. Where are you? And what do you want? We. Oui. That question has a long damn answer. Right now, I'm safe from those prison assholes. But I cannot say the same for you. Look, the prison warden. 
He's injured. I'm just trying to keep him alive. So, they let you out of the prison. Then they're just gonna let you back in? Right. But you aren't helping them? No. Something about this situation, about you, doesn't fit. Look, why don't you tell me where you are and maybe I can help you? <laughs> help me? Shit, man. You can't even help yourself. Are you the one that's messing up the convict's plans? Maybe I am. Maybe I'm not. Either way, I'm not telling you. How do I know you aren't really one of Donner's boys? Trying to trap me. Donner. So you know about him. Wake up, man. This is all about Donner. Don't you get that? And I'm the only thing standing between that fucker rotting away in solitary and an evil bastard being unleashed of the rest of this frozen hellhole. Well, I mean, I hear it's nice in the summer. Take care of yourself, Mr. Mackenzie. Those wolves sound pretty hungry to me. I'll do my best. Well... That was weird. This is just terrible. Can't tell if anyone made it. Looks like someone's been here recently. You're tougher than you look. I found stuff to help the warden. Medical supplies. Yeah. You'd better get in there to see him. He doesn't look too good. But first, you gotta let me frisk you. Mattis had have my balls if I let you sneak a knife in here. Who the, who the hell are you? Relax. I'm your neighbor in cell 15. Oh, yeah. Mathis is pilot. I cleaned you up the best I could. You might have a broken rib. Maybe more. Mathis opened up a couple of bad cuts on you, so I stitched them up. Gave you a shot of antibiotics. Hopefully that'll prevent serious infection. Thanks. You, you seem to know a fair bit of first aid. Well, I'm married. I, uh, I know a doctor. And, uh, I get hurt a lot. With, with friends like Mathis, I'm not surprised. Oh, Mathis is no friend of mine. We'd, we'd better hurry before the guards come back. There's something I need to tell you about the prison. I'm listening. Solitary. It's, a, it's on its own locking circuits, separate from the rest of the prison. Mathis and his guys, they haven't figured that out yet. But when they do... When they do, they'll get Donner out and there will be hell to pay. They blame you for Donner? Mathis thinks I use some kind of override to keep Donner locked in there, even when the rest of the cells went haywire. Well, did you? N nah, nah, it's... I can't figure it out. But someone is out there messing with the system, messing with Mathis, and keeping Donner inside. Uh, I might have an idea of who it is. You see someone out there? Not saw, 
but I talked to someone on the phone. Right. The old rotary phone system would still work. Redundancy for when the sad phone goes down. Right. Shit, they're coming back. Get back in your cell. You gonna be okay? Just don't let them find you in here. If you get to talk to whoever it was on the phone again, do whatever they ask. Because right now, they are the only thing keeping us all alive. Think we can trust him? The enemy of my enemy is my friend. How'd that happen? Wow. <laughs> yeah. Must be glitchy. <laughs> These idiots think I'm a fool. They don't think I can figure out what happened here. But they were too chicken shit to take care of the warden themselves. And sent you out into the cold to do their dirty work. And you. Risking your life to save a guy you don't even know. What a fucking Boy Scout. That's me. You still don't get it. Don't you see that in this new world, Mackenzie, Boy Scouts will be the first to die? And yet, here I am. Well, smartass, if you're gonna make yourself useful, you're gonna make yourself useful to me. Am I? Yes. You are. And why am I gonna do that? Well, because... Hard case. Right. Get back out there, pilot. Go find out what's wrong with this place. What do you have in mind? Well, obviously there's something wrong with the power. Though he's been no help, a map in the warden's office shows this place has its own power plant, so... Go check it out. Give me some power, so I can open the gates to solitary. Right. Power. Solitary. Got it. And Mackenzie. Yes? Don't dawdle. Or... The warden gets it for real this time. Math is said to give you this. That doesn't look like a coat. That's cause it isn't. It's a bit of a map. Shows the way to the dam. Looks like you can just follow the power lines or something. It's cold out here. I won't find the dam if I freeze before I get there. Do I look like a guy who gives a shit? You don't want to freeze out here? Then get moving! Bastards. At least this map looks real enough. A landslide. From all those quakes. I have to find a way up and around. so cold in my life. Now, let's see about that power. Hello? Me again. So, they sent you to check on the power plant. 
Yeah. I mean, that's what they asked me to do. You always do what hardened criminals ask you to do? Only when they ask nicely. You know you won't be able to get the power back on, right? The issues with the power have nothing to do with the power plant. Yes, I know. I mean, how are you so sure? Trust me. I just know. Trust you? Okay, trust goes both ways. What's your name? You can call me Jace. Okay. Nice to meet you, Jace. So what are we doing here, exactly? Well, I don't know about you, but I'm not here to work on my tan. How do you fit into all this, Jace? Are you in trouble? That psycho Donner makes it out of solitary, and we're all in trouble, Mac. Well, it's better than Mr. McKenzie, I guess. Listen, you want to know what's going on with the power and all that? I can tell you. But first, prove yourself to me. I need your help. Where are you right now? That's not important. How did you end up at Black Rock? Car broke down when the first Aurora appeared. Well, not so much broke down as just stopped working. Like most things. It was freezing. So I got out and started walking down the road to see if I might find someone else. Or maybe some shelter. Got turned around in the darkness and snow. Everything looked pretty much the same. Wandered for hours. Nearly froze to death. Then I found a fence. Followed it and found a guard tower. Next thing I knew, I heard gunshots. It was horrible. The shots were, there were so many. I waited half an hour, longer, crept up, and I could see them slumped against the wall, blood everywhere. It was guards, prison workers, civilians, innocents. They had executed them. I had to get out, but I know the area a bit. There's nowhere to go, really, not on foot. I don't know if anyone's coming to help, but I figure I gotta do what I can to keep those fuckers locked up. Donner, he is evil. If he gets out, nobody within a hundred clicks of this place will be safe. And if this thing lasts as long as I think it will, that would be very, very bad for all of us. What's the situation with Donner? I guess you don't follow the news much, huh? Donner's a psychopath. They have a law about something, this guy's broken it. I hear his old man Mathis isn't much better. But Donner, Donner is a once in a generation criminal. Yeah, I can confirm that Mathis is not father of the year material. Wait, you know him? He's how I ended up here. It's a long story, but yeah. He's here to break Donner out. Shit, shit, shit worse than I thought. What's the worst that can happen if he gets out? He gets stuck out in the wilderness and freezes to death, or gets eaten by something. Wrong. Donner gets out, he will make it his personal mission to find and hurt every living human he can get his hands on between Black Rock and the mainland, just for shits and giggles. You worried about anyone in particular? Never mind that. We gotta keep him in lockdown. That's the only thing that matters right now. Okay, so... How are we gonna make sure he stays in solitary? Trust. That's how we're gonna keep him in. What do you mean, if this lasts as long as you think it will? Do you know something about what's going on? Never mind. I just know stuff, okay? Or suspect it. Sounds like you think it's more than just lights in the sky. It's not more than lights in the sky. And yet, it is. That's pretty cryptic. Let's stay focused on Blackrock, okay? You want to prove you're trustworthy? I mean, I want to help, yeah. What's in it for you? I don't much like Mathis. And he's got something I need. What is it? Metal case. What's in it? I'm not really sure. Hey, trust goes both ways, right? I'm not hiding anything from you. 
I really don't know. So then, just leave. Get out of here. Leave Black Rock and let the chips fall where they may. I can't. I need it. If you don't know what's inside the case, how do you know you need it? It's important to someone who's important to me. They were ready to die for it. So I need to get it back. Right. Well, maybe we can help each other. You do something for me. And I'll find a way to help you with your little problem. Deal? I feel like I'm gonna regret this, but... Yeah. Deal. Okay, listen up. Even with the power out, there are physical mechanisms that the convicts can manipulate to get Donner out. I mean, they are morons, but even morons get lucky sometimes. We need to fix things so they can't accidentally break them out. And how do we do that? Well, it just so happens I have the plans to this ancient thing. I mean, a lot of the original structure and prison systems are probably Victorian era. Solitary is newer. But the stuff under Solitary? Still old as shit. All right. How does that help us? We get underneath, and we bust up the systems that manage the locking and unlocking mechanisms. And we basically, well, we turn the gates into walls. We seize up the system, and it's so old, so heavy, it'd take a goddamn nuclear bomb to break them out. Let's hope. You don't have a nuclear bomb, do you? Steam tunnels. Steam tunnels, right. What about steam tunnels? You get into the old steam tunnels. You'll find an access door in the rock face just outside the power plant. Other side of the spillway. According to these blueprints, they lead you, more or less, right to the old locking mechanisms under solitary. More or less? Well, there are some stains on the map. And a few areas that are a little fuzzy engineering-wise. I mean, it's old. But yeah, eventually you will get to the locking mechanisms. Okay. And then what? You tear out or smash anything that looks remotely like a switch, fuse, panel, cable, wire, vacuum tube. You get it? Yeah, I get it. Sabotage the thing. Exactly. You do that, and Donner is locked in for good. Probably. Probably? Hey, I'm not a prison designer, okay? But yeah, as I read these blueprints, probably. Okay. Wish me luck. I mean, it'll definitely buy us some time. I think. I'm going now, Jace. Hang on. What? Good luck. Remember what Jace said. Locking mechanisms.
You're still alive. Shit. Looks like I lost that bet. Any luck with the job Mattis gave you? I made it to the power plant. The whole place is dead. Nothing obvious to be done to get it running again. Too bad. Mathis will be disappointed. Oh well. Back in your cage, Doug. Psst. Hey, you awake yet? Yep, I'm here. Any luck at the power plant? If by luck you mean I managed to not get the power back up and running, then yeah, you could say I had some luck. You found them, didn't you? Whoever's out there messing up Mathis' plans? Not really, but I spoke to them again. Whoever they are, they really don't like Donner. Well then, we have to do whatever we can to help them. Okay, but how? Just keep doing what you're doing. We have to find a way to slow Mathis down. A little hard to do that from inside a cell. Maybe not. Quick, get back. Well, well. Look what my guys found while investigating the old parts of the prison. Someone is seriously fucking with me. Someone who clearly knows more about this prison than they should. Knew exactly what to sabotage to keep us from getting into solitary. You know anything about this, pilot? I have no idea what that is. Sure, I figured as much. Whoever did this took a big risk and went through a lot of effort. For nothing. We found another way in. A big-ass key that will unlock the door to solitary, or any other door we want. It's called dynamite. Damn it, Mathis. Haven't you done enough to my prison? Shut your mouth! I'll deal with you later. Listen, pilot. It's time to get back to work. What now? Detonators. Can't do shit with this dynamite unless we find detonators. Since we found the dynamite in one of the machine sheds, the detonators should be around somewhere. Of course, we can't find them. So, I'll probably have to go a few more rounds with my friend the Warden here to find out where they are. You just sit tight, and I'll tell you when I'm done. You may want to plug your ears. Now, listen, Mathis, there's no need for that. Come on, Warden. Don't ruin my fun. The detonators. That dynamite is old. We kept it in storage because we didn't have a safe way to get it back to the mainland. That's a nice story. Wait, wait. But I know where you can find some. I'm listening. Old mine. In the hills, just above the prison. It was shut down suddenly for safety reasons after the quakes, but most of the gear was left up there. I bet there are some detonator caps up there. Interesting. You heard the man. Get going. Yeah, talk. Time to get back out there. W wait. Mathis, just... Leave him alone. I'll do it. I'll be quick. You better hurry up, pilot. I think Mathis wants to let off some steam. Wait. Mathis. What a blizzard. It won't be much use to Franklin if I get myself killed.
That's what I'm looking for. to sabotage the locking mechanism, but that won't change much. Math has found dynamite, and soon, thanks to me, he'll have detonators too. He plans to blast through to solitary and get Donner out that way. Shit. Time for the nuclear option. But I thought you said you didn't have it. Relax, Mac. Figure a speech, right? What are you gonna do? We're out of time. I've been gone for too long. Atwood's gonna be pissed. What did you say? Huh? Nothing. Just said we're running out of time. No, no, after that. Oh, right. Just my thesis advisor. She's the only reason I'm out here at all, Mackenzie. I'm a grad student, astrophysics. So? So? It just so happens that this part of Great Bear offers one of the best unoccluded zones. Ideal for setting up certain sensitive instruments for my research so that... I have to see her. You have to see my thesis advisor. You aren't making any sense, Mackenzie. It'll take too long to explain. We need to get out of here and get to Atwood as soon as possible. Oh, okay. How do you know about her? And what about Mathis? And Donner? If they make it out, there's a good chance they'll end up finding Atwood. And that's a big part of what I'm trying to prevent. Where is she? The Suzuki Radio Telescope. It's about 15 to 20 clicks from here. That's where I was headed when my car stopped working. I've been living there, doing research for months, alongside Dr. Atwood. Mackenzie, if the convicts find out about the radio telescope, it'll be bad. It's an old government facility, so there's all kinds of supplies there. Food, medical equipment, vehicles, radios. They could hunker down for weeks, months, It'd make a hell of a base of operations for all manner of evil shit they might get up to. They could prey on everyone within a hundred clicks. Blackrock is a fortress, but it's broken. It's been broken by the Aurora and everything that's going on right now. But what the hell is going on right now? I'm not a hundred percent sure. But astrophysically speaking... Yeah? It's pretty messed up. Look, Suzuki is shielded. Due to the kind of work they do there, it's shielded from electromagnetic radiation. There's a good chance that all the shit that's been going on out here, that it hasn't been affected in the same way. Which means? It means Suzuki may be the key. So, how do we get out of here and stop Mathis and Donner at the same time? Um, not sure. But I have an idea. Just buy me some time. I'll do what I can. Good luck to us both, Mackenzie. Oh, shit! So, pilot, did you finish the job? 
I found the detonators. Well, I guess the warden was telling the truth after all. Now what? Now, we blow a hole in the wall. But first, let's you and I have a little chat. Hey, Mathis. I did everything you asked. Oh, I know, pilot. You've been a good dog. But every dog has its day. Whoa. Wait, hey, fellas. So, here we are again. Yeah. We have to stop meeting like this. Me tied to a chair, you acting crazy. The problem I have, Pilot, is that you keep lying to me. I don't know what you mean. You see, that's exactly the kind of thing that pisses me off! First, you pretend not to know anything about the case. I really don't. Then, you go around behind my back, purposely trying to mess up my plans. With an accomplice. Mathis, I... Shut your mouth! All I hear are lies. I know everything. You monster. He didn't do anything. I know. He was so innocent. Just one of the good guys. But he sang like a bird when we laid into him. He couldn't give you and your friend up quickly enough. I know about your pathetic activities to slow me down, Mackenzie. It, it makes me laugh because the only reason I kept you alive was I thought you could fly us out of here, back to the mainland. But I'm starting to understand that here, here, we can be kings. Back there is nothing but fire and cold. The old world. My crew and I, we're gonna rule Great Bear. Nobody can stop us. Not you, not your friend, nothing. We aren't going anywhere. So you've outlived your usefulness to me, pilot. And when I'm done with you, I'm going after your little helper. What the hell is going on? What happened? <clears throat> the detonators. They blew too early. Something happened. The guys fucked it up. <sighs> you assholes! Solitary? They're clearing the rubble. I can't see shit for all the smoke right now. There's fire everywhere. I suppose you're pleased with yourself. You'd better hope nothing's happened to Greetings, my- Greetings, convict assholes. This is your friendly neighborhood prison hacker checking in to say it's lockdown time. I can't see! I am going to destroy everything you love. Uh, Mac, whatever you're gonna do, you 
I'm here. You made it to the warden's office. Good. You'd better get what you need and get the hell out of there. Quick. Did you cause that explosion? I might have nudged it a bit. But mostly those idiot convicts did it to themselves. The PA in lockdown, however. That was all me. I have the case. Okay. Hang on a sec. Okay, here we are. Warden's office. Okay, so. End of the hallway you just came out of. Take it. You'll end up on the roof. Cross over the building and you'll find a fire escape thingy. Come down there, and you should recognize where you are. I'll meet you at the power plant. I can see lights in the prison yard. Fire. You'd better hurry. The whole security system has gone haywire, and I have no idea how long the lockdown will last. Mathis and Donner could be after you in a minute. Go, go, go! If you let him get away, use the lights. If you let him get away, Relax, Mac. It's me, Jace. Right. Well, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Thanks for your help back there. Thanks for yours. That was one hell of an explosion, huh? Yeah. I'm trying to figure out what happened there. Well, I might have just had a little bit to do with that. You should have seen Mathis's face. <laughs> that guy had it coming to him. Could you see what was going on? Hacked into the security cameras across the prison. That's how I was able to keep an eye on you and the rest of it. Well, what now? Yeah, I mean, this is as far as my plan went. You have any ideas? We have to get to Atwood. I still don't get it, but yeah, we do. I'm worried about her. With all this going on, 
she's fragile. Okay. Well. Shit! They found us. That was faster than I expected. Okay, well, uh, you have the blueprints, right? How do we get out of here? I don't know. This was the extent of my plan, Mackenzie. Isn't this prison escape gig more your thing? There has to be another way out. Shit! Trapped! This is not how I thought this would end. And things were just starting to look up. Okay, whatever happens. You're like a bad penny, Mackenzie. I've been called worse. You know, it's amazing to me that a smartass like you has made it this far. Like I've always told you, you have no idea how stubborn I am. It's too bad being stubborn isn't the same as being smart. And this must be the fly in the ointment. A girl, no less. This is the end of the line for you and your friend, pilot. I'm not afraid of you, asshole. I've been fighting guys like you all my damn life. Well, today, you lose. In more ways than one girl. Mathis. What is Donna. it? The explosion. He's her bad. This wouldn't have happened if not for you. You've been a pain in my ass for too long, pilot. It's time for the bad pay to pay the ultimate price. But first, you can watch me deal with the girl. Good. I like them to struggle before they die. Yes! That's what I like to see, Mackenzie! A little fight! A little will to live! I knew you had it in you! Mathis! Mathis! He's dying. His daughter is dying. Seemed like a good idea at the time. Looks like Black Rock's on fire. Huh? It actually looks warm. First time. I've missed the place. Hey. Hey. Hang in there. I'll... I'll get a fire going. You'll be warm in no time. <coughs> it's okay. I'm warming up. That is not a good sign, Jace. Just... Just wait. Hang in there. It'll be fine. Everything is going to be fine. You know, Mathis, I'll just go. come after us. He'll never 
Stop. Yeah. Neither will we. Another one, in the water. But not drown, like the others. Must not be a quarantine breaker then? Is it another one? This one is different! It can't be. Watch it. Might be infected. No, not her. Is it? Big water. If she doesn't look good. Get her some water now. Astrid, you came. You said you would, and you did. But where is the case? Where's the cure? 